beautiful. Look at this. Gorgeous. Could it be more beautiful? This Overcast. is art. And it's so middle. obvious that this is an artistic neighborhood, right? This is where the rich people are going to be. It's Paris. It's basically Paris. Bushwick. It, Paris. No, it is Le Bushwick. But it is, in fact, the new neighborhood for art. Couple Hard to believe. A couple of good galleries here. Yeah, at this least. Is one of them. Luring Augustine. And uh, showing Tom Friedman, an artist we both like. So maybe with a bit of luck, this will be half decent. Under everything in this gallery, right, is Blue's Styrofoam. All right, so but what does he call these pieces in the wall? Because these are new, these works. Totally new, a total he departure. And he calls them what? Sculptures of painting, which by itself, that's very Tom Friedman, you just get a conceit. He just says, right. sculptures of painting. I'm gonna see what it means to make sculptures of painting. One of the great things that Tom Friedman gets you to do, though, is to look at things that you think you know once, twice, three times, over and over again. Uh, the more obvious the material, the more obvious the object, the more you need to be paying attention to it. So this thing is entirely carved from... Styrofoam. I think of it as like a paint blob floating in space, a zero gravity paint blob. We don't blob. know whether it's going up or down, so zero gravity basically yeah, really sort of just, does come into it. But there's, but, a, but there's a giveaway, and where is it? It's on the pedestal. The pedestal is always with him as part of the work, and it turns out we can see that it's actually carved from styrofoam, there's a chunk taken out of it, a bite taken out of it, just to show us what's going on a here. A telltale blue color. Okay, I want to go into the corner here. Okay. A tiny dot, this is classic Friedman, right? A tiny dot, you wonder, what is it, what is it, what is it, what is it, what is it? And then you see an eyeball, a freestanding eyeball. The artist sign? Got to be either, well, it's the artist and it's also the viewer, it's also us, right? We're being invited to surveil this entire show. What he seems to be doing with just about every piece he puts together. He looks at it and he pays attention to the one thing about how to basically give that thing a twist. Yeah. Yeah? It'll give it meaning. So he manages to use carved styrofoam to represent a huge swath of art history, in right. fact, right. and styles. It's a joke, a single joke, but it's got a lot of legs. He's retelling it in a number of different ways. It would be so easy. If this were in Chelsea, where you've got 100 galleries to go to in whatever hour you've got to spare, it'd be very easy just to do the classic, you know, oh, once good. around the gallery. You're totally right. Oh, yeah, nothing here for me. Yeah, it's all just That's an excellent a bunch of point. paintings. That's an excellent point. And then and you're out. And then you fuck know. you, you missed it. Yeah. You idiot. Which is you great. Yeah, you yeah, idiot. Absolutely. Me I idiot. That, you know, I, I, I mean, any you can imagine any of us could right, do that. Absolutely. We all absolutely. do that. What about uh, our play on Jeff Koons here? This is the untied balloon dog, right? Yeah. This, is, yeah. this is, but of course, styrofoam, again. Lighter that, than air. Also a lovely reference to the kind of good minimal sculpture from the 1960s. The thing visually works, which is usually the case with Friedman, right? I'm far more interested in this than I am in a Carl uh, Andre plate. You know, this is, and just lovely little things. I mean, I don't approve yeah, the, of the, craft the, the, the all detail. that much, but that is beautiful. To think that he carved the knot in the goddamn balloon out of styrofoam, I that's totally beautiful. Agree. I totally agree with you. Obviously, we both hate the work, yeah? Completely. <laughs> I, 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 will, I will step back from it for a minute. I was, me too. Disappointed. Me I have to too. admit, I was disappointed because I'm used to having uh, something close to a one-liner, a jest, a quip. He's from showing him generally, right? But you know what? This this is weird enough that I respect it. So it's I a think show in the end, huh? Yes. Yeah. Surprisingly, for for a show where nothing's more than an eighth of an inch thick, it's a pretty deep show.